Hey everyone! Today I'm going to be showing you the Animal Planet Dino Adventure Mountain playset. This playset is full of parts and pieces. It's got a truck, it's got a huge Spinosaurus, it's got this gate where you can drive the truck through, and it's got accessories and more people and dinosaur and all kinds of stuff. Let's take a quick look at the box before we open it. Okay, right here it says it takes two AA batteries, but they are included. It comes with two batteries. And let's see, on the bottom right here, it says it's made by the Toys R Us family of brands. So if you're looking for one of these, that would be the best place to look. Toys R Us store or online. On the back, there's a very nice picture. They've got the playset set up in some sand. So it looks really realistic. It's got a crane on the top. Here it shows someone playing with it. Looks like the sign does something special. Here's some information. You can pause it if you need to read that. There's some other stuff on this side over here. Let's see, can you read that? I'm not sure. I hope you can see the detail. And that part right there. And here's some cautions. All right. Let's get this thing open. Okay, there is one piece of tape on each side. We'll cut it like so. And it should come right out. Here it comes. It's fighting, doesn't want to come out. All right, I'm gonna get this out and I will be right back. All right, let's see if I can get everything out. Okay, first of all, there's these little guys right here. They were attached by this plastic strap to this base. Okay, so here's this one. I don't know if they have any names. I didn't see anything about their names on the package, but we have this guy. He's got a nice green shirt and some equipment. Let's take a look at his face. Okay, and there's this other man right here. Oops. Oh, okay, so he's got this white bag. It's a separate piece. Looks like it can come off. Let's put that right back on. All right, he's got some headphones or earphones. He's got a nice vest and cool shorts. All right. Okay, next, let's see if we can get this off. Not quite sure how these come off of this the base. Okay, that was a little bit harder than I thought. Okay, so we have this guy right here. It's very cool. The light is kind of weird. Let's see if I can fix that. All right, a little bit better. Um, oops. He's got. Nice detail on the skin, and nice face. The inside of his mouth is not painted red or pink, but oh yes, his tongue is painted. And he's got a few spots and stripes. His, his stomach is yellow. Very nice. Okay, let's try to get this off. He's got two of these black things so I'm gonna pull have to pull really hard oh there's there's little arrows on these you just unscrew them all right let's try to unscrew them that works much better yes unscrew them do not pull them off they have screws very very nice designer alrighty here comes the Spinosaurus. That was so much easier than I thought it was going to be. All right, now he has batteries in him, right from the factory. He does this. He does three roars when you push his hand down. Either hand. Okay, let's see if moving his legs does that too. Are his legs attached to his arms? This one is not. This one is not. All right, so 
you have to just touch one of his arms, push it down to make him roar. Wow, look at that sail. Is, is it my imagination or his sail a lot shinier than the rest of his body? I think it is. Does this turn? This, this comes off like that. It goes back on. He's got some words on his feet. And there's the speaker holes. His tongue is painted. The inside, the top of his mouth is not. He's got lots of teeth. Nice eyeball. Look at these scales above his eye. The other side is painted the same. So let's hear him roar one more time. Alright. Awesome. Let's put him aside. Okay, what's next? How about this vehicle? Oh, is there the black things? Yes, there's a couple of these. I'm going to unscrew them and it's going to fall a bit. Okay. Here it comes. Now this thing is really cool. Oh, it's got a weird twist tie right here. What is this holding on? Okay, this is holding something closed or open. I'm not sure. Okay, there's this. I don't think that's important. Here's another twist tie. What does this do? Oh, look at that. The whole thing opens up. So you have easy access to the inside. You can put your people in there and pose them and then close it up. Okay, now what's this here? This opens up. Is there supposed to be an engine in there? Or is that like a trunk? The steering wheel kind of turns. And the wheels are not painted. Okay, this has the Animal Planet logo on the sides and some safety caution colors on the top. It's got this gun and this gun right here and a peg for people. All right, and we might take a, another look at that a little bit later with some more accessories attached. Okay, next we have the gate. The gate has two of these black things. Sorry, I'm hitting the camera. Okay, here it comes. Okay, I don't think we need this bottom part anymore. Let's get rid of that. Alright, so this is impressive. Alright. First of all, it's got this large crane on the top. Oops. I am super hitting the camera day. It's just that kind of day. All right. So this turns. All right. It turns all the way around. And there's some nice little trees. There's this gate or cage. Kind of looks like a jail, but it's probably just a door in case you don't want to open the big gate. Sorry this is taking so long. I don't know. I'm never no I'm never sure if you guys want me to show you how to take stuff out of the package or not. Okay, that opens up. It's it's nicely um it's got a nice friction to it so it doesn't fall. You just have to push it down. All right, and let's see how does this work here. All right. It's got Oh, that looks like a button almost. Let's see. What does this do? I'm not sure. Okay, this... Oh, okay, so here we go. This turns and opens the gate, I think. Oops, wrong one. Alright. And that stays open like that, and this is nice and right side up. And I guess if you push this, it's gonna fall. I haven't read any of the instructions, so sorry if I'm getting anything wrong. There's a ladder right here. Ladder goes up to this little platform. And there's a tree. More trees. Alright. Uh, I think that's all the 
Okay, there's a hole right here, but all right, that, that's pretty much what's on the gate for now. Might look at it later. All right, then there's all these little pieces. All right, I'm going to take another break and check out if there's any instructions and try to finish putting it together and set it up real nice for you. All right, let's take a closer look at the truck with what you can do with it. All right, so, okay, the peg that you saw earlier, it's, his foot doesn't go all the way on it, it but it does fit nicely, like he's not going to fall off. Okay, so you're supposed to be able to put his hands on this weapon like this, kind of, and um, it's a shooting weapon, so you have these discs, and it can only hold one at a time, but you push it in, it's a pretty nice fit, and then you need to push this lever in, and it fires, and it's a, it works really good, and you have three of the discs, and each time you want to shoot, you have to put another one in, like so. It's, it's really nice. All right, so then we have this guy is inside. As you can see, he fits in there pretty nicely, and I think his hand is on the steering wheel, and his feet stick out the bottom, which is kind of dangerous. Okay, and then we have these accessories right here. Also, there was a separate accessory, which was, uh-oh, this was this backpack right here. It comes off, and it's got that hole right there, so it's probably better to keep this on to cover that hole up. Alright, and then we have all these things. Okay, I think this one is supposed to go on the truck because there's a nice peg right there, and a, I think it'll fit in one of these two holes right here. Let's see. Oh, no, that's too loose. How about right here? Uh, no. How about one of these holes right here? That's too loose. Hmm. I wonder where this camera can go. Do you see anywhere where it can go? I don't think it goes on the gate. I don't think it goes on the dinosaurs. So, let's see if he can hold it. Yeah, I guess I guess that's all you can do with it. I thought it was going to go on the truck because it's such a nice round peg. As you can see, the other accessories do not have uh, a peg like that. Watch. Here comes this one right here. Don't fall. This is a... it kind of looks like a f flashlight or something. I, I really have no idea. Maybe a gun. But it has a normal handle, like something a human would hold. So let's put that in his hand. Alright, and he holds that. So why would that have a handle and this have a peg? I don't know. The lighting is kind of weird on this. Sorry, it's hard to light up this big set. Alright, so here, this looks kind of like an iPad. Or could be any other brand. doesn't have to be an Apple. But it's some type of technological device. And then we have, this kind of looks like a water bottle. Let's see. I mean, it could be. They're outside. They need some water. You have to keep hydrated. Oh, it could be a propane torch, too. Okay, and then there's some binoculars. Okay, I looked at the box, and I looked inside it, and I looked everywhere, and I did not see any instructions, so... It doesn't tell you how to put stuff together, or what stuff is, or what stuff's called. Okay, so binoculars, and... Oh, oh! I'm gonna move all this outside for some... Uh... So it'll look better later. I'll... After I show you all the little bits and pieces, I'm gonna take this outside. Okay, there's a camera. Nice little camera. And... Here... Oops! I... If that... If you're wondering what that noise is, it's me hitting the light. Alright, so... There's this thing right here. Not quite sure what that is. It's only got one good side. Uh, I guess there's a handle on the top you could hold. So, let's give that to him. 
Come on, guy, hold it. Let's put it right there. Okay. There we go. He's got his little gadgets. All right, sorry, my camera shut off and I had to record this again. This is the last accessory. It's got a handle at that end and some other stuff at this end. It could be a tranquilizer stick or something, I'm not sure. But also, I changed the lighting and the camera angle to show you something really cool. This part of the dinosaur is translucent. You can see light through it, like so, and it lights up really cool red when you hit it with the light, like that. Alright, I'm going to go outside now and shoot a short action sequence, and then I will be right back. Get out of the road, you stupid dinosaur! <laughs> Open the gate and get the truck! We got an emergency out here! everyone I hope you enjoyed this video please like or favorite if you did and please subscribe to see more because you never know what kind of videos I'm gonna make next I've got tons of toys and I'm always buying more all right I hope to see you next time bye